All right guys, Eddie of Fliptronics, and I'm gonna be going over how to use Safari and manage tabs on iOS 15. Now iOS 15 is a lot weirder than iOS 14 when it comes to both of these things, so I'm gonna go over it slowly. First thing I wanna do though is show you that I'm updated to the latest iOS version. And of course, if you guys could smash like button on this video, I would definitely appreciate it. Okay, so let's open up Safari and just check this out. Now the first thing you're gonna notice when Safari's open is that you don't type in at the top, it's at the bottom now for web addresses. So you need to tap here in order to you know type in a website you wanna to go to. The other thing you're gonna notice is there's a little three digit icon, which is like a settings tab. Now you can actually pull this up a little bit to take a look at some of the other settings within here and then you can actually add more so you can kind of like get rid of some add some which is pretty cool and then we've got tabs now tabs are also completely different on ios 15 which you're going to see so let's take a look at this now i like the layout of it i think it looks really nice honestly and uh you know browsing through the tabs just looks so much better than on ios 14. all right so some other things you could do is have tab group so let's say you got a bunch of tabs but you don't want to close any of them you could actually create a new grouping within here which is kind of weird but at the same time it's whatever i mean i feel like normally you're just going to close tabs when you're done with them you don't need to create groups but it is an option on here right now um you know other than that some other things you can do here after you create that group you can uh you know still swipe to get rid of tabs so if you want to clear them out you can do that kind of like on ios 14 when they would just be like grouped up you know in a row and then you can actually switch the tabs by scrolling at the bottom so if you want to just go through the tabs like this you can do that as well and that's basically it guys but safari is completely different when you're when you're using it. and then managing tabs is also you know a lot weirder but i do like it all right hope you guys enjoyed this i'm going to be doing a bunch of other videos on some new features within ios 15 so if you could smash the like button subscribe to the channel if you haven't thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one